Hey, welcome back and we're glad you're here at mid-morning on WKYT. The Foster Care Council provides clothing, education and mentorships to Kentucky's foster children that have been removed from their home due to abuse or neglect. The group is getting ready for their upcoming golf scramble next month to support their efforts. And joining me this morning to talk about that is Cassie Sloan and Lindy Hester. And it's good to see both of you. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. Uh, so this is, is touching folks at a, at a very uh, key and important time. Uh, mm -hmm in their lives, certainly. Right, absolutely. Um, we started the Foster Care Council back in 2012, and with our main platform being education. Um, the majority of children come into care testing two to three grade levels behind. So we'll go in and we will tutor the children one-on-one -on -one until they test on grade level and I, you know, gearing them up for graduation and setting them up for success. And then we also pay for our extracurricular activities. We have the mentorship programs, and then we provide free clothing in our unique boutique, Studio 54. Um, we write grants, but we also need, you know, the fundraising money is very important. So that's why we're here today is to promote the golf. And it has to be so rewarding when you see them uh, make these improvements and, and get back on track. Right? Absolutely. Yeah. The smiles, um, the appreciation that, that we receive from the children and the foster families is very rewarding. And it's so important to these to these kids. Well, let's talk about the, the event coming up and other ways that people can uh, support uh, the organization? Yes, yeah, so on October the 11th, uh, we have our sixth annual Tee It Up for the Kids. It's going to be at the Marriott Griffin Gate. We're going to have a um, live silent auction that's going to be taking place in conjunction with the event. So we're really excited to be able to welcome um, the golfers. We have a few spots left. We have some sponsorships left. So please reach out to us or you can go to our website, which is um, teeitup2021.com. Mm -hmm. And such like a, you sort of make a big event of it. I mean, oh, a, a yeah. party atmosphere, some good sure. food and all of that, right? Absolutely. You Lunch, come? dinner. Oh. Yeah. yeah, the awards, the awards <laughs> ceremony is always fun. Yeah. Right. Yeah, so. How many folks get involved just, uh, you know, at a level like that and then really buy into what's going on and see the difference they can make and, and get more involved with your organization? Uh, the, the community's been so wonderful in helping us get where we are today, and we've helped hundreds of kids through the years. Um, but there's so many ways that people can help. So if they just go to our website, thefostercarecouncil.com, they, they can see all the different ways to um, help us continue our mission. Are you seeing more and more uh, children in need? Oh yes, yes. We actually had a couple of um, young gals coming yesterday to um, shop at the at the studio, and uh, it's just literally the most rewarding thing because this one little gal, she went from being kind of sad and not really smiling to trying on clothes and seeing herself in a different light. It was really, really wonderful, and we just continue to see more and more kids like that. It's really just the best job. Yeah. Well, there's info on the screen about the event Monday, October 11th, starting at 11 at the Griffin Gate Golf Resort. Tee it up for kids, 2021, and uh, folks can. And you go to tee it up 2021.com get mm -hmm. more information right yes and maybe get involved thanks for coming by thank you it's always thank you good, good to hear about something uh, uh, so nice that's going on thank you thank you and